stood before a judge Wednesday morning charged with his half-sister's murder. I love my son. He's a good boy. Through tears, family of both William Micah Hester and four-year-old Joanna Lockabee sat on the other side of the glass in Greenville County Bond Court. I know in my heart that Micah would not do anything like this on purpose. And not premeditated nothing on purpose. If he did, he, he was out of his mind crazy. Hester is accused of suffocating four-year-old Joanna. Greenville County deputies say she was found dead in the woods behind the home they both lived in on Chevy Chase Boulevard in Pelzer. Just 25 minutes after deputies say a family member reported her missing, deputies say Joanna's body was found in a plastic bin. We're still trying to uncover what led up to her death what the motive behind her death was, and a lot of that is going to be uh, pending the autopsy. Hester's father spoke in bond court Wednesday, saying he loves his son. Micah would not do anything like this on purpose, and he wouldn't. I know, I know my boy, and I can hold my hand up to the Lord and testify to that, because I know him. He's, he's a good boy. He's never been in trouble, and he loved his sister. Esther with his head down quiet during his bond hearing. We've lost little Joanna. I just don't want to lose my son. I'm just asking to have mercy on me. The judge ultimately denying Hester bond, ordering him to stay behind bars. And deputies say Hester is being charged as an adult today. The judge said Hester will be held in the Greenville County Detention Center temporarily and then transferred to the Department of Juvenile Justice in Columbia since he is 17. The coroner says an autopsy for Joanna is scheduled for tomorrow. Live in Greenville, Kylie Jones, WYFF News 4.